Dwight D. Eisenhower was born in 1890. He grew up in a small town of Abilene, Kansas. As a boy, Dwight liked to read and play sports. He sometimes thought about what he would be when he grew up, but he never could imagine the life he would live. After he graduated from school, he went to the West Point Military Academy to be an Army officer. While in the Army, he discovered new ways to move takes around and proved to be a good leader. During World War II, Dwight D. Eisenhower was asked to be in charge of the armies of all the good guys who were fighting together against Nazi Germany. He was called the Supreme Allied Commander and made a five-star general. His greatest accomplishment was organizing a massive attack on Normandy, France. This was called D-Day. A lot of men died that day, but the good guys won. After the war, he ran for president and became the 34th president of the United States. As president, he was known for building the interstate highway system. Sometimes you can see signs on the road that tell you that they're a part of the system. Notice the five stars? Eisenhower also started a space agency called NASA. Soon, NASA would send a man to the moon. The Dwight D. Eisenhower Memorial is located in Washington, D.C., right across from the Air and Space Smithsonian. Let's go visit the memorial. The memorial features two sets of statues, each representing one of the two major jobs that Eisenhower had. One as Supreme Allied Commander and one as President of the United States. There's also two giant pillars, which also represents his two major roles. Behind the memorial, there is a steel tapestry that is eight stories tall. That looks like a rock on a beach. It's really cool when you see it lit up at night. It depicts the cliffs of Normandy where the D-Day invasion took place. As a boy, Dwight got the nickname Ike, which he kept through his life. During his campaign for president, his slogan was, I like Ike. This statue shows Eisenhower as a boy in Kansas looking towards his future. I think that statue over there represents um, that he's looking forward to what he's going to be when he grows up. What do you want to be? For Halloween? <laughs> no, when you grow up. A scientist. We could think to do science things. Eisenhower never could imagine what he would do over his life, but he did some pretty amazing things. See you on the next part!